What's up? What's up, people? What's up? All right. <clears throat> I just want to um, give you a little game on how to um, on how to get streams so Distro Kid could pay y'all more money. You hear me? Um, first of all, you know, you got to upload on Distro Kid. All right. And um, second of all, you gotta upload consistently, you feel me? Like, you gotta upload at least every month. Like, you gotta upload at least like five to ten beats a month, you feel me? Then, um, then you gotta um, use the uh, promotion, per, uh, promotion stuff on DistroKid. Like, when you go on DistroKid, I'm not really gonna show you on my screen right now, but um, y'all can do this yourself. Um, go to this little kid, right? And then when y'all click on um, the little four little things that's next to your uh, picture, um, you click on promote yourself. When you click on promote yourself, then you're gonna um, do the Mimi video generator. You feel me? You're gonna um, apply those uh, videos to your music, you feel me? And then you're gonna post them on social media. Well, um, I can say for me, it worked with um, Facebook. I didn't even know like people could blow up on Facebook like that. Like, I mean, I knew, but I didn't think like people was gonna actually listen to my music on Facebook. Like, like, I mean, I already knew my friends wasn't like gonna actually check out my beats whenever I post but I'm talking about like other people like random people like that you don't even know um I would post the uh, I would do the Mimi video generator with this little kid you gotta go on their website it's free too and then um you apply your music to the videos they got the funny videos of people dancing and stuff and then um uh uh uh, uh people would listen to it and stuff like that and then um you can put in your caption or uh, search for this, search for that, you feel me, on YouTube or whatever, Spotify, you feel me? But um, for me, I didn't even post nothing. Like, I just posted on Facebook just to post it. And then um, um, uh, my beats would get views. Like, people would be sharing it, sharing the video, because the video funny, you feel me? So they would share the video. So by them sharing... That's um that's good because other people that like that's really interested in the song would actually go search for you on YouTube and stuff like that. You feel me? And um and then the second thing y'all could do is when you go to DistroKid, when you go to the part that says on uh, goodies and it says get heard now, you go to the third one which is on uh, Wheel of Playlist. You feel me? You go to Wheel of Playlist on your DistroKid account, and when you go to Wheel of Playlist. Then you can um you can um get a spot for free on a um, digital kid uh, playlist that they have on Spotify. You know? And then um for some reason I feel like when you do when you do that they like there's people that have um playlists like other playlists and stuff like it don't matter if it's famous playlists like 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 small time playlists and stuff like that. There's people that um that would go to the uh, Digital Kids Spotify playlist, and then um, they would uh, they would listen to the songs and pick and choose which songs they want um, they want to add to their playlist for free. You feel me? So you don't even have to like worry about like buying spots to get on people's playlists and stuff like that. You feel me? Like all you gotta do is do the wheel of playlists, and then. Um, and then, um, if they like your stuff, you will be added on some playlist for free. You know what I mean? Like, when I first started doing it, I was getting a lot of, um, streams from Spotify just because of, um, DistroKid with a playlist. And, um, you gotta keep up with it, though. You gotta do that, like, every day, because they're gonna email you to tell you when they're gonna, like, when they bump your music out of the playlist. You feel me? So you gotta do it again to try, um, a different beat or stuff like that. You feel me? Sometimes I try like different different beats, different songs and stuff like that. But um, um, when I first started it, 
they would pick some of my beats and some of my beats would be um, on uh, other people uh, playlists that I don't even know you feel me like and I would get plays from there and um, I used to be happy about that but for some reason though the reason why I, I keep posting videos to tell people stop messing with music for Tyson because I don't want them to go through what I went through, you feel me? Because once you um, go with music advertising or play to the club or whatever and start paying for, for streams, I don't know how they know, but for some reason, they would stop, like, adding your music to their playlist, you feel me? Like, a Wheel of Playlist would still do it, but you're not going to get added on other playlists for free, you know what I'm saying? Like, you're not going to find other people that's adding your music to their playlist, you feel me? Stuff like that. But um, that's why I'm gonna stop messing with music advertising and try to keep telling people about them. But um, as far as um, getting organic streams, those are two ways that you can get organic streams. You feel me? And then um, the third way is to me is the third way is like a cheat code. You feel me? You got good stuff and people gonna listen. But um. There's this website called uh, YT Monster. I think that's short um, for YouTube Monster. But um, you go to that website, you don't even gotta pay for it. You do it for free. All you gotta do is um, watch people uh, videos, and then and you get points, and in exchange, people will watch your video. You feel me? So that's not fake stream. So cause, because it's real people actually clicking on your stuff and then listening to it or watching it. You feel me? And then, um, but the only downside to that, though, is um, most of the people that's um, from that website is from India for some reason. You feel me? But um, I had started doing that also. And then for some reason, like, I still need you to drop a, a track. You go to YT Monster and you put it on there. You feel me? And then you start, like, getting views from zero to, like, probably, like, 50 or 20, 30. You feel me? And then um, eventually... The algorithm will pick up your your music or beats. I do beats most of the time. I, I rap on my beats too, but not all the time. You feel me? But I be doing it with beats, and um, for some reason, it will pop up like, and um, it would be the 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 distro kid uh, beats, the the ones that they they automatically sent to YouTube. You feel me? And then um. When I post like automatically straight up to YouTube, my stuff won't get organic views like that. Unless if it's about something that I'm helping y'all, you feel me? I'm trying to help y'all from not messing up, you feel me? Like a video like this, you feel me? But if I drop a beat straight to YouTube, I won't get views no matter what I, like, no matter what I do, you feel me? But if I drop it straight from DistroKid, then boom, I, 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 um, I start getting play. I'm gonna leave a link down in the descriptions so y'all could um so y'all could get a discount from distro kid once y'all start y'all you know, account you feel me i'm helping y'all so y'all can help me you feel me and also subscribe down below you feel me y'all gonna see my beats on there um most of my beats don't pop up on my um channel but y'all can um search it all the time king of your hood beats you feel me or go um in fact, I got paid beat be stars, they money, because they took down my website, kingofyourhoodbeats.com, you feel me, once I got paid them tomorrow, I'm going to pay their ass tomorrow. But anyway, um, to get back to it, YT Monster was kind of helping me, though, I ain't going to lie. I stopped, I stopped using them, because um, I realized, um, just to see if I was going to get views automatically, and, um, and I actually did, you feel me, I use them sometimes now. I don't use them all the time no more because um, I'm already getting the organic streams thanks to y'all. And um, but I'm I'm trying to help the beginners, you feel me, the people that's not really getting streams at all. You feel me? Right now, my main goal is how to get at least like five thousand to a thousand streams a day. You feel me? Like, cause I I do get streams like that. You feel me? But it don't be that much every day. Every day I probably get like 10 streams, 10 to 15 streams, feel me? but I want it to be more. And um, at the end of the month, it'll probably be add up, you feel me, to like 
500, 300, 1,000. And if I keep dropping shorts, oh, that's another way also to get streams. Once you're dropping with Digital Kid, now you got to use your YouTube directly to promote your beats. You feel me? Just don't drop beats on YouTube directly because anybody can steal it. Um, when you drop straight to Digital Kid, you know, even if somebody steal it, um, they're going to get copyright. You feel me? Because they're not giving you credit. Unless if they go to this Kid and give you credit, then they, they won't get copyright. But um, the other way to get streams is... Oh, shit. I forgot what I was saying. Yeah. The other way to get streams is um, by posting shorts. And um, it don't matter what you what your shorts about. You feel me? As long as you could post a good short, so you could get um, you get a lot of views from the shorts. You feel me? Because the shorts is like a cheat code, also. You feel me? Kind of like TikTok. Shorts is a, 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 um, a cheat code. You drop a short. You feel me? And also have your beat on it. As long as your short can generate streams, then um, it's a big possibility that people would. Go to your um, go to your account, and then also as long as your short is generating streams, when people go watch videos, they um, they will get recommended to your um, music that they haven't saw or listened to. You feel me? That's another way. I think that I already told you like three or four ways already. And then um, oh, and another way, the most tricky way that nobody really know about is um, you have to show love. To the producers on YouTube or Spotify, you feel me, or Audio Mac, it don't matter, you feel me. Like, like I would go to Audio Mac and I would add people. Like, if I listen to a beat and it doesn't sound good, I would add it to a playlist. Like, I would call it like underground artists or underground producer or producers, and I would add them to my playlist, you feel me. And then when they see, oh, this person added them to the playlist, they're gonna get happy, you feel me. Then they're gonna go check me out. Who, 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 who that is? Who that is just adding me to their playlist? You feel me? Same with YouTube. You feel me? You got to add people on, a, on, a, on your playlist. You feel me? That's going to get them happy. And they're going to be happy to check who you is. You feel me? Because nine times out of ten, they probably think, oh, it's something, somebody famous or or it's a, it's a playlist that's famous. You feel me? So they're going to go click on it and check to see who um who added them to their playlist. You feel me? And the, another way also, after you start showing love, you got to comment on people's stuff. You feel me? It don't matter if it's bad or good comments. As long as you comment and tell them they beat sound good or they beat trash or whatever the fuck. Well, excuse my language. Or whatever you want to tell them. You feel me? And then um, once YouTube, the algorithm realized that you like to listen to music and um and stuff like that. And then um, you like to comment on people's music and stuff like that. They're going to realize that. Then they're going to... Uh, 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 recommend you other people music like artists that's trying to make it you feel me that's the artist you gotta try to look for you feel me not famous artists you gotta look for artists that's trying to make it you feel me then they're gonna recommend you people um new music and once they recommend you people new music then um then you'll go also like comment and stuff like that and you can comment oh I just subscribed to you bro it sound good uh return the love you feel me? Stuff like that. And then people will boom, boom, return the love. Because they already know if they don't return the love, you're going to um, unfollow them and stuff like that. You feel me? But to make uh, 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 the video a little, uh, not too long, that's about all the ways that I actually get my um, get organic streams. Like, there was one time, though, um, I think it was in December or November, I had dropped a beat. It's called... Um, I think it's called London UK Drill Beats and I dropped it in the first week my fact first couple of days I was at a thousand um, streams then I got to like 2,000 streams 3,000 streams I was happy as hell bro like like for, for going to two three weeks I'm at 3,000 streams I was happy and then I'm thinking if I go mess with music advertising they would boost it even more you feel me so instead of promoting that song that beat, I ended up telling the music advertising to promote a song that I have on YouTube. Then they promoted that song. That song had a thousand streams. 
Then they ended up putting it up to, um, no, I think I had 800, naturally. And then um, they ended up putting it up to 2,000 and like 200 something, 42 likes. You feel me? That ain't even help. That stopped my other beat from getting plays. You feel me? My algorithm was like, I was getting organic streams from uh, uh, um, the, the, the Finland. Finland was the biggest, was my top country. If you mean that I was getting streams from, I was getting streams from Finland, Russia, uh, Ukraine, even Ukraine. Ukraine and Russia was listening to a beat that I had called War, War Already. You feel me? Ukraine and Russia was listening to that beat. You feel me? Uh, 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 from England, from United Kingdom, from uh, uh, Finland. You feel me? Once I paid for music advertising, they went and put all my stuff to the United States. Now, uh, uh, they giving me fake streams from the United States. And then once I stopped paying them, now I'm getting um, um, organic streams from the United States, but it's slow. Very, very, very slow. And then, um, like, I'm talking about very slow. And then um, I stopped getting streams from Russia and all them places, but, like, it's coming little by little now that I stopped messing with music advertising. I only messed with them for one month, you feel me? And, 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 and they just took a little money and, took, and, 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 and they didn't even tell me, oh, here, $25 back at at least after I spent sixty dollars with their ass, you feel me? But anyway, um, there's a lot of ways to get organic streams. You don't have to buy streams. You feel me? As long as you got good content, good uh, 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 music, or uh, good beats that sound good, that don't sound like hurting people's ears. You feel me? People will listen to it. But um, like I said, also you gotta drop shorts and um, regular videos to help people out. You feel me? To, to trial and tribulations that you go through, you feel me? So like that, people could um, show love to and appreciation to actually go listen to your beats and stuff like that, you feel me? And another thing I did also, um, I made um, I made my girl, my girlfriend, uh, well, she made her own account. I was trying to sign her to my digital kid account, but she ended up making her own account because she's talking about I'm going to steal her money. But... <laughs> Regardless, I'm still getting paid from her anyway, cause um, I made her make two songs. She dropped one. As soon as uh, she dropped her first song of my beats, I made her use my beats so like that I get fifty percent. She get fifty percent. You feel me? I told her she act right. Then I I take twenty percent and she get eighty percent. You feel me? But she keep yapping and cussing me out and stuff. She she gonna get fifty percent. I'm gonna get fifty percent. But anyway. The first song that she did, and that was her first time even picking up a mic or ever even trying to write music, you feel me? Um, she got Spotify, on Spotify she got 1,500, 1,500 streams in like a month. Organically, like she don't even, she not even the type to even go to social media or Facebook to share her music, you feel me? She not even the type, you feel me? All, all I told her to do was every day go to the... um wheel of playlist on the distro kid uh website and then add the song uh, uh to a playlist they're gonna they're gonna choose um the time that um the amount of time the amount of uh the, the placement like the spot you get like if you if you get first or second or third spot on the playlist you feel me? sometimes i'll be getting like i'll be all the way to a thousand thirteen hundred you feel me? but anyway she did that for almost like every day and then she got like fifteen hundred on streams organically on, on on Spotify, and then one day I woke up. She was showing me she got added to Friday Vibes um playlist on Spotify. Friday Vibes playlist on Spotify was like it's like a playlist that they um have a, a lot of artists that they watching and stuff like that. You know on Fridays and stuff like that. You feel me? But anyway, she ended up getting a lot of views from there. And that was the first time. You feel me? Um, and then um. Or I get the split, also the split payment. And then um, I just made her drop another song, second song, like last week. That's like five months gap, so I don't know how it's going to work, to be honest. But um, that also helped me out, you feel me? Because I would go to her YouTube and I will put like, hey, I made the beat. Because some, um, as soon as she posted on YouTube, some people was commenting, t saying, um, oh, um, they like... Um, they like the song when she gonna drop the next song and stuff like that. You feel me? But anyway, yeah, I gotta put in the work. Like I said to myself in 2023, I would make a, a beat a day, but I've been slacking lately. You 
January because I probably started in January and February start making a beat a day or two or three beats every week. But for March, I've been slacking. I probably dropped like three beats for March. You feel me? But anyway, that's all y'all got to do, man. Um, put in the work and they got to promote y'all stuff too. You feel me? And um, yeah, that's all you got to do. Um, I can only make mu- uh, 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 videos about distro kids and stuff like that. I can't do nothing about beat stars because I haven't been making a little money with beat stars, so I don't know. Leave a comment down below. You feel me? Like I said, I'm gonna leave the link so I can get a little discount of distro kid. You feel me? But that's actually how I get um organic streams. You feel me? Like um, and then also um, everybody that I know, like everybody that I meet, I would tell them go to YouTube and subscribe to me and stuff like that. You feel me? Like right now I'm at 344. I gotta get up there. You feel me? Because I'm pretty sure I know a lot, a lot more people. But anyway, um, show some love. You feel me? Subscribe, like, go listen to my beats. You feel me? You don't even have to buy my beats. Just listen to them. You feel me? I mean, I get paid for once you click that play button. You feel me? All right, peace out. Bye. Smoke my, smoke my little live. You feel me? Peace out.